welcome to this tutorial video about how to service and overhaul your mechanical disc brakes the sole purpose of this service is to clean all the darts inside trap king thoroughly and uh, to relieve the internal bearing arrangement let's start first we have to unscrew the cable attachment bolt then we have to unscrew the parting of bolt we are doing it before uh, removing the caliper from the adapter uh, they are pretty tight so when the caliper is mounted this will actually help you to apply your force and unscrew those parting of bolts no need to fully uh, remove them but uh, if you just break them out then uh, the rest of the work will be easier let's do that and then remove the caliper and the cable now remove the main mounting bolts on the adapter or on the fork or on uh, directly on the frame for uh, rear brake and remove the caliper then uh, unscrew the valve adjuster there is a plastic uh, body here yeah, it comes this small screw then in between them there is a coil spring then remove the cable attachment bolt there is a holding clip as well unscrew the pad uh, retention uh, screw then pop out the brake pad both side keep them aside as we have already uh, loosened the parting of bolts uh, pretty much easier now just unscrew the parting of bolts just like that there is a technology in tip pro called uh, something pad adjustment so as you can see uh, there is some uh, washer type top cone adjustment becomes parallel to the disc brake rotor so by this technology actually take to uh, provide the 100% pad contact let's forward to the next step removing the actuating side removing the caliper arm there is a 4mm allen bolt it's pretty tight there is a hexagonal slot as you can see sometimes they are jammed sometimes they are just pop out uh, by the spring retention uh, the spindle of the actuating side is actually hexagonal i have to apply some force there is little bit of far pages i have to file them up there it comes and as you can see pretty much dirty everything i have to clean them up and then i have to uh, there are three ball bearings inside i already cleaned and reused the internal as you can see there are three progressive uh, ball bearing groups which actually create the progression of the actuating piston you can see a small hole there as you can see there is also a small hole in the actuating arm the narrower side will be on the outer side and position the caliper arm properly then screw the 4 mm allen head bolt 
as you can see this is working flawlessly now now join the two halves of the caliper and give it a full tight then clean your hands obviously uh, then insert the pad adjust the caliper as per the procedure and enjoy yeah.